Hi everybody. I know it's a little bit late this evening. I actually thought I wasn't going to be able to do it because I'm on a mission right now. I'm trying to accomplish something. I'm trying to get something. And this is what I'm trying to get done. I'm trying to get into this door. You see those signs there? It says keep out, beware, caution, post it. It just seems like it's trying to keep me out of that door. Now I get into this door. I have, I have, a, I have dynamite. I have a mallet that I, I, you know, beat down the door. I have a, a crowbar that try to help me to pry into the side of the door there, a little crow thing. I even have this here knife, and this knife I can just kind of try to wedge into the side of the door, trying to get into that door. I have this little doodad here. It's, I don't know what it is, but it's really not been very effective. And I have keys. I have, I have keys. I have lots of keys. And still, I get in this door and I don't understand why into that door you know what that's like a lot of us God shuts doors on us the Bible says that God opens doors that no man can close and he closes doors that no man can open and we exert so much energy trying to get in that door when all of the warning signs are there telling us don't do it, telling us, turn around, go back. And yet we continue and insist upon getting into that door. What are you talking about, Sabrina? Well, relationships in, in business ventures and in, in new jobs and ministries and moves and investments and in, in girlfriends, boyfriends and in, in getting married and all different types of situations. There are times where God tells us, no, stop. This is not for you. But we are so determined that we're going to get through that door. We're going to push through, kick in, do what it is that we have to do to be able to do what it is that we want to do, even though God has shown us all of the warning signs. You know, that's not wisdom. We should allow God, the doors that he closes, we should allow them to stay closed. This is wasted energy. This is wasted resources, busting down a door that God has closed. God is a good God. He's closed them for our protection. He's closed them for us to take care of us. Now, they may not be closed forever. There may be a time I come back to this door and there's no warning signs on it. But for this time, for this season, God has said, do not enter. Caution, stay out. The best thing for me to do is to put down all my tools and start utilizing my resources, looking for the door God has opened. If this door is closed, there's a door of opportunity open for me somewhere else. And that's what I need to be investing my time, my energy, and my resources in. This is Sabrina with your Night Night Nugget saying, look for the open door. Stop trying to bust down the closed one. And for those who are at Faith Outreach Church tonight, I just want to tell you, last Sunday I had already knew this is what I was going to do. Went and looked for the signs today. Isn't it amazing? God is trying to tell me something. I don't know about you, but I'm listening. Night-night.